what is up all my dumpster peeps how in the heck are you guys it is a beautiful day outside the sun is shining it is seven o'clock p.m and sad news today it's just gonna be me and you guys no bath today she is struggling again with sleep i mean she always struggles with sleep but it's been a few days since she's gotten any sleep and she is just not feeling it tonight so i said it's okay girl i got this all by my lonesome i can do it she'll probably be blowing my phone up all night checking on me <laughs> but i can i'm so i did this for the first two years by myself so I got it. I mean, I'm not scared to go by myself at all. It's of course just so much more fun going with my best friend and having somebody to chit chat with the whole time and joke around with and somebody else other than myself to laugh at my own jokes, you know? <laughs> like I can, I can laugh at myself all the time. <laughs> that ain't a problem for me. But it is nice when somebody else laughs along with you and like, you know, someone else thinks you're funny. <laughs> anyway, um, so I went to the post office today and oh my goodness. First of all, first of all, I went to the Pope, Pope office. <laughs> it's going to be one of them days where I can't talk. Oh wait, that's every day. Um, I went to the post office on Monday, which was four days ago. And I got two full carts of stuff donations from you guys for all of the organizations that we donate to. If you're new to my channel, hello, hi, I'm Shannon and I dumpster dive to donate. I also have a ton of subscribers that are amazeballs and send me donations to send to all of the organizations that I love to donate to, which is just, <laughs> it is, I, I don't even have words. Like, it's just so amazing the community that we have built yeah that's just a little side note there but on that note i'm gonna zip it and we're gonna go straight to the dumpsters so everybody cross your little fingers and toes that we have some good luck it is still the same week of my birthday so maybe just maybe we'll still have some good luck so let's go jump on in these dumpsters and see what they got for us tonight all right guys this is a dollar general First dumpster of the night. Let's go see if there's anything good in it. All right, guys. How oh, good. It's looking empty, but I'm going to check it. See if there's anything good in there. And it's so windy outside, guys. That's why I'm leaving you in the car. dumpster dollar general and it looks like it might have been emptied <laughs> oh man this is no bueno man no bueno okay so there's some pop in there but trying to think how I'm gonna do this all right, I'm gonna go check Family Dollar because they're leaving soon. And then we're gonna come back here and I'll set my ladder up and jump in and grab everything I can. Throw it in a bag and go. Let's go check Family Dollar real quick before they close. Cause they're, oh, we got soda. Soda, soda, and trash. Let me set you guys up in the car while I grab all this out.
Can't breathe, child. Goodness. All right, now let's go back to the DG. I seen Cherry Pepsi, so I'm like super stoked about that. I came back to the Dollar General and said, you know what, I really gotta pee. Cause you know, I just like jumped on that dumpster with my stomach and burst my bladder. <laughs> so I ran in and was like, excuse me, may I use your restroom? She turned around and was like, no, we don't have one. I was like, I'm sorry. I've never ever been to a Dollar General where they said, no, I couldn't use their restroom. All right, let's go get all this pop out of this dang dumpster. the bottles of cherry Pepsi, a 12 pack of cans, cherry Pepsi, a 12 pack of Pepsi Zero. And I don't know what these other cans were, but I just grabbed them. <laughs> now to go find a potty before I pee my pants. <laughs> well guys, I'm at Rite Aid now. <laughs> I guess it's night for pop. <laughs> All that Sprite and it looks like Coke, but I can't set you up. So I got to just show you that uh, they're in there and then grab them out. So, man, I gotta be bad. Actually, it wasn't Coke, it was Dr. Pepper. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> now to go find a potty. No, yes, potty and then Dollar General. <laughs> I gotta go so bad. <laughs> all right, guys, we are back at the Dollar General that just gave us all those cases of non expired food. Check it out. We have tons of medicine, some toys, some tanning oils. There's all kinds of stuff in here. A loofah. Of course, they dumped out all the dog food or cat food, whatever that is, but I'll get the rest of it. I gotta jump in now, so I'm gonna have to set you guys on the car. That was all clearance stuff. So I don't know if you guys remember, um, I always follow Krista coupons on YouTube. And um, she said there was a huge clearance sale, like 50% off all their clearance stuff. I think it was last weekend or the weekend before. So that's why that was in there because whatever's left over from their clearance sale, usually they throw away because they're trying to get rid of it. Now we're at Michael's. Let's see if there's anything in here. All right, Michael's looks like a bunch of garbage. That's what it looks like. Mm-hmm, that's what it is. Oh, I just smacked myself in the face. Nothing here, on to the next. Actually, on to the bathroom, okay, before I pee my pants. It's that old age, guys. <laughs> Can't hold my bladder. Okay, let's go. I need to go pee and then we'll go to the next one. All right. Oh, they are so stinking sweet here, guys. 
They put it by the back door for me. Look at how sweet they are. Only downfall is these donuts don't last. Oh, these are good until April 6th. Never mind. Those are good. They're so sweet. I don't even have to jump in the dumpster. <laughs> I'm seriously going to bring them Christmas presents this year. All right. So I have checked um, two more towns and found zero. But we're going to go check another town. Two, three, two more towns. Why are my windshield wipers on? <laughs> we're going to check two more towns and hope to goodness there's some stuff there. So, All right, guys. We're a big lot. I think we got clothes. I think. Looks like there's some in this bag. Let's hope. Let's hope they're new. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Thermal shirt. What else do we got in here? We got a pajama shirt. Ooh. And then the matching pants. That's actually super cute. Looks like we got another set. There's a pair of pants. Yeah, let's just take this whole bag. It's getting cold, guys. I am freezing. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. So, of course, there's trash. Thought I, thought I heard somebody. <laughs> Freaking myself out. Another pajama shirt. Some broken something. And a little chamois towel. And the rest is trash. That looks like it's about it. So we'll take our pajamas and thermal shirt and the towel and be on our way. Not too bad of a score. Not too shabby. I like when we find clothes though, because that's always a great donation, especially women's clothes. All right, guys, we are at the next CVS. Let's see if there's anything good in this one. If there is, I'll come get you. Nothing. Nothing at all. Guys, last dumpster of the night. The pet dumpster. If there's anything, I'll come get you. Well, that's gonna do it. We didn't do as well as I had wanted to, but at least we were able to save some soda and some meds that's an awesome score so definitely not like my birthday dive <laughs> but you can't win them all so as you guys seen i went out i don't even remember it was four days ago i don't know i just worked all weekend my mind ain't working because i'm working on like six hours of sleep over the weekend, so bear with me. I went out on this dive by myself because Beth was struggling, man. She was riding the struggle bus. She did not get much sleep, so I was like, I got this. I can do it by myself. I did get a little freaked out at one dumpster, but <laughs> it's okay. Like, every little sound will freak me out when I'm by myself, and I was never like that, but Beth has me so spoiled now. <laughs> And I'm so used to having her with me that every little tiny sound, I'm like, what was that? <laughs> As you guys seen, we went to a few dumpsters. We didn't have the best of luck, but I'm actually shocked at how much I was able to find because normally when I go out three times in the same week, and you have to remember, I'm hitting all the same dumpsters three times in one week. I did not think I was gonna get even as much as I did. So I'm actually quite surprised at what I was able to find. With that being said, let's jump in to everything I got at the dumpsters. Where the heck did I go first? Where the heck did I go first? So the very first dumpster that I headed to, of course, was 
well, that I took stuff out of. Because the first dumpster I went to that I found stuff at was the Dollar General, but then I had to go back and they wouldn't let me use their potty. <laughs> I had to be so bad. I was so mad about it. But anyway, nobody needs to know about my potty breaks. Okay, okay, Shannon. Anyway, I went to the Family Dollar because they were getting ready to close and I was like, let's get your booty and gear because if there's stuff in that dumpster, we got to get it out. And wouldn't you know it, I found soda. We got pop at a couple different dumpsters. So yeah, it was a pop night, that's for sure. So in the Family Dollar dumpster, we got all the two liters. We got... How the heck many is there? I guess I should have counted before I did this. We got six two liters of Coke, three two liters of Sprite, and two two liters of Dr. Pepper cherry. Then I ran back over to the Dollar General. They had Pepsi. We never, ever find Pepsi in the dumpster. And the reason for that is we actually found this out from a uh, Pepsi employee. So all the Coca-Cola products that are near expiring or are expired, Coca-Cola does not have a employee come in and take those back out, but Pepsi does. But Pepsi will take it with them. Coca-Cola does not. They just leave it there and they say, you can toss this, it's getting ready to expire or it is expired. When we went to that Dollar General, I was so shocked to see Pepsi. Like, <laughs> I don't know why, it's not that big of a deal but it's just something you never see in the dumpster. So we got two six packs of the, what are these, 20 ounce bottles? I don't freaking know. 16.9 ounce bottles, two of those. I got three of these cans, which I had no idea what these were. I was like, these are some kind of weird energy drink. And then I read, it's Mountain Dew. These are Strawberry Melon Spark, and these are um, energy drink for Mountain Dew. I didn't even know they made these. Huh. Learn something new every day. One 12 pack of cherry Pepsi cans. Lastly, I got the, what is this? Pepsi Zero Sugar. Not too shabby, I would have to say, out of the first two dumpsters. But then I went to a Rite Aid dumpster. This Rite Aid dumpster, we just recently found it and we have been checking it every single time we go. I think we found something there once. I don't remember what it was, don't ask, don't know. Brain isn't working today. We were able to get three bottles of Dr. Pepper. Did I say three bottles? Three six packs. <laughs> three six packs of Dr. Pepper. Lord, I'm so, <laughs> it's gonna be, it's gonna be a struggle today, okay? Bear with me. Three six packs of Sprite also. Then I was like, well, let's just go and head to some Dollar Generals. And the Dollar General that is so amazing, I love, love, love their employees and managers there. They are the store that is so nice. I drove up and I was like, oh my goodness. They set a box beside their back door for me. <laughs> they are so amazing there. There are six packages of donuts. And like I said in the video, they are best by April 6th. So those are still good. Because that's why we don't take these. Because normally when we find them, they are already so far past their date. And these things just don't take, they get hard and you know, it's hard to keep donuts past the best by date. So that is usually why we don't. Also in this container, we got two white rain men, three in one. Then we headed to a um, big lot. The only thing that we were able to find in that dumpster was PJs. Look at how cute these are. These were $9. Each set was $18, $9 for the pants and $9 for the shirts. How stinking cute though, right? I was like, okay, big lot, stepping up your PJ game. Two sets of those, both a size small. We got one women's large isotoner PJ thermal shirt and one, I don't know what I called this in the video. Did I call it a chamois? Microfiber, microfiber. I was like, chamois, what the heck's a sham? Is that like a sham wow? <laughs> Do you remember that infomercial? Sham wow, and that guy was like crazy. <laughs> I don't know where I come up with this oh, stuff. Then we headed to the last Dollar General, and Lord Shannon, pull your shirt up, girl. When I peeked in that dumpster, I did not expect to see all this because this was the dumpster that when we went out on my birthday, we found all those cases of food that weren't expired. 
So when I seen all this, I was like, oh, snap. Okay, I am down for it. Let me give you a little wink here. So let me flip y'all around and show you what we got from the Dollar General. God, I messed this whole thing up. I had it all organized. Let me reorganize it first. <laughs> I jacked it all up. Lice free spray, some Renew contact solution, the loofah, $10 Rhine World's toy, three boxes of Polygrip, two Fixident Ultra, two Fixident Plus with scope, three mucus DMs, two tubes of toothpaste, one Aleve liquid gels, two ace bandages. I've never seen these things, goodies. It's aspirin. I've never seen those in my life before. How cool. Two Pure Tone Rexall Band-Aids, one Sensitive Skin Band-Aid, Knee Support, one Wooden Plaque, Hawaiian Punch, five High C Fruit Punch Singles, a ton of Ibuprofen PM, I don't know, but there's a lot there. Two Dark Tanning Oils, two Airborne Immune Support, and two bottles of Vitamin D. And that, my friends, is everything I found at the dumpsters. Not a crazy, you know, tons of stuff haul like my norm, but we got tons of medicine, which I'm so super excited about. Even just stuff like aspirin. All these places that we donate to need stuff like this, even Band-Aids. So things like this are always in need at those types of places. So I am super excited that we found all this. And of course, the soda also, that's always a great donation. I mean, it's not the healthiest, but it's something. I mean, I would prefer to find bottled water to donate, but beggars can't be choosy. What I have been hiding behind you guys <laughs> is the massive amount of donations. So I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek because Miss Tara is gonna be coming tomorrow to pick up all of your donations and all of the stuff Beth and I have gotten out of the dumpster all last week. There's no way she's fitting all this in her car. This is gonna be a two tripper. <laughs> so let me show you guys real quick all of your amazing donations. It is crazy, guys. Look at all the ramen. Ramen on ramen on ramen. <laughs> to get the full effect, let's start over here. So we have dumpster stuff all over here mixed in with some donations. More dumpster stuff, all the clothes, and then boom. I have a little path to walk through, and that is it. <laughs> thank you all so very much again. I can't thank you guys enough. You guys are just amazing, and I absolutely adore each and every one of you. Well, that is going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you so very much for hanging out with me by my little lonesome self at the dumpsters and for hanging out with me today in the reveal. Of course, Beth will be back with me at the dumpsters tomorrow. So be on the lookout for that video coming later on this week. And I, of course, will talk to you all in those comments down below. And until next time, guys, happy diving.